Hello everyone, this is Ronnie. I'm here for my 16th day of my 90 day video challenge. Today I'd like to talk to you about when a close friend, as a couple, have a marriage breakdown. And what happens and how they feel. And it's a very, very sad time for everyone involved. But I think it wouldn't be such a bad time if their friends would be there for them to have a shoulder to lean on instead of interfering. This close couple of mine, these friends, have only recently broken up and if it wasn't for the woman in the marriage, they wouldn't even be friends. He left, he's with somebody else and he's listening to all the gossip she is isolated, she hasn't basically been out of the house very much at all. She'll come over and have a cup or whatever, but people keep calling in on her, which is good, but when you have all the other people around, gossiping, 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 it's none of their business. Now he's listening to all this and thinking, oh, who's saying this, who's doing this? Grow up, everyone. Mind your own business. They had a breakthrough today. They sat down together only because of the woman. Had a good chat. They know they'll never get back together again, but at least they may be able to stay friends. She said to me after she was talking to me today, you're very quiet, you're not saying much. And I said, as long as you're happy, I'm happy. But try not to voice an opinion. It just causes trouble. And your friends don't need any more trouble than what they've got together. You can be there for a shoulder to lean on. But people, what's the old saying? People in glass houses should not throw stones. Be supportive. That's all I've got to say. Support your friends. Don't interfere. Until tomorrow. Thank you very much. Bye-bye.